Well, hello there, my friends, and welcome to Land of War, the beginning. This is a game actually made by a Polish company and clearly trying to draw a little more attention to the actual invasion of Poland in 1939. Now, there's a few different ways we can approach this game, and I've heard that the American voice actor, the English voice acting is really terrible. Um, so I'm going to stick to Polish audio here. Um, with English subtitles. I think that's really the best way to play the game. Maybe the Polish speakers will be somewhat better. Um, but let's take a look and see what's in this game. I really don't know what to expect. I've heard uh, a lot of like very mixed reviews. Some people saying it's not worth your time. Other people saying it's really cool. You should take a look. So let's just jump right in. All right, let's do the classic um, Land of War gameplay with realistic difficulty. Actual progress and game saves will be removed. No, I don't want to do that. So let's do casual. Uh, oh, I see what they meant. Never mind. Let's go back to classic. They just mean any progress we had on a previous campaign. Zaczęło się. Siły niemieckie wkroczyły na nasze terytorium. Mają wielką przewagę zarówno w liczebności... Yeah, I think the Polish voice actors are much better. So I'm glad we did Polish with the English subs. ...a to dopiero początek. Musimy za wszelką cenę spowolnić pochód armii niemieckiej. Nasi sojusznicy muszą wyczuć nasz zdecydowany opór. Muszą wiedzieć, że zdobycie każdego skrawka polskiej ziemi jest okupione krwią. Tylko wtedy możemy liczyć na ich pomoc. Tereny w pobliżu wsi Mokra są kluczowe w realizacji tego planu. Osada położona nieopodal granicy będzie stanowić doskonałe miejsce do obrony. Zasadnicza część sił wroga uderzy od strony lasu na nasze okopy. Musimy tam wytrwać tak długo jak to możliwe. W razie potrzeby w odwodzie czeka na nas wsparcie gotowe ruszyć, gdy tylko otrzyma sygnał z pobliskiej radiostacji. Dotarcie do niej może jednak okazać się problematyczne ze względu na niemieckie oddziały rozciągnięte na całą szerokość naszych linii obronnych. Jedno jest pewne. Razem. I tylko tak możemy zwyciężyć. A jeśli nasz los jest już z góry przesądzony, to też razem zginiemy w obronie ojczyzny. All right, very cool. So if... If it comes down to it, we'll die together defending our country. So we've been ordered to hold off the Germans at this village right on the border um, of Germany here. One thing I want to do is just send out... Oh, let's, ooh, hold on a second. Let's see if it powers through. Okay, it did. Uh, I'm just going to send out a warning here on Discord so people can see that we're streaming this. All right, let's get into the combat and see what the game has to offer. Here we go, folks. Still loading, actually. It's a little strange. See, the loading is actually the burning cigarette. It's pretty cool. Welcome to Mokra. Zostałem przydzielony wraz z oddziałem do obrony przed pola wsi Mokra. Po drodze łączyliśmy się z napotkanymi wojskami. Dobrze było być wśród swoich, śmiać się i wzajemnie motywować. Nie mogło to jednak potrwać zbyt długo. So I think this is the first time I've ever played from the Polish perspective in the invasion of Poland, which is pretty cool on its own. 
Ale jesteś mi już winny drugą paczkę. Dzięki, pamiętam. Jak tam panowie? Fajne było to, co? Idź do diabła. <laughs> Matko, co to za fatalna pogoda. Nie maru. Zawsze mogło być gorzej. Na przykład? Na przykład, gdybyśmy się tu zakopali i już teraz musielibyśmy dołączyć do reszty. Coś w tym jest. Muszę przyznać. Andrzej, dobrze się czujesz? Coś blado wyglądasz. Oj, chyba nerwy nie wytrzymują. Oho, zbliżamy się już do naszych pozycji. Słyszałem, że Niemcy mają duże ilości wojsk. Oby nas ominęli. Nad ranem wielu zostało zbombardowane przez ich samoloty. Całe miasto stoi w ogóle. Wieluń! Przecież tam nie stacjonują żadne nasze wojska. Tak. Też mi się to nie mieści w głowie. Dobra. Skończcie te pogaduchy i skoncentrujcie się. Dobra. Let's do it, boys. Get prepared for the German assault. Brać się za rozładunek. Wszystko musi się jak najszybciej znaleźć na swoich miejscach. Kowalski. Tak, panie poruczniku. Ty idź przenieś amunicję do okopu. Skrzynie są kawałek dalej. Rozkaz. Alright, pretty standard here to just uh, start moving stuff over to the trench line. I like that. Whoa! Holy hell! What a wake-up call. Niemcy zaatakowali. Wszyscy na pozycję do okopu. Get to the trench line. HDU's first aid, all right. Whoa. Let's get into position, boys. ERQ, four to a, use a Polish grenade. They have different keys for German and Polish grenades. Fair enough, though. Let's move up. Come on, boys! For Poland! Gotta watch our health as well. This is pretty exciting, I have to say, just stopping the German invasion here. We don't have any grenades yet. We're trying to just shoot down the enemy. Reload. Oh, let's take cover. Oh boy. Let's make sure we remember what the actual key is here for um heal. Hold on. <laughs> it's gonna take a while to remember this stuff. Interact. Uh med pack H. Hey Mike, how you doing? Expected a strategy game, yeah. It's uh it's an interesting FPS, let's put it that way. Okay, so he is getting that health back. We do have one of the grenades. Enemy tanks. We're gonna have to get on the cannon. Holy hell. Now we're on AT gun duty. Oh no! All right, well, we gotta get a different cannon. We're down to eight, 10 health. Oh my goodness, here we go. Whoa. Machine guns may overheat. Cannons do not overheat, but after each shot, you have to wait until it gets reloaded. We're just gonna have to use the anti-tank rifle, my god. Hit it. Hit it. Come on. Got one, boys. Germans will never attack us again. All right, there we go. Not too bad. Might as well use an anti-tank rifle on the enemy. All 
All right, let's see if we can't get on one of those machine guns or at least just keep them back with the rifle for now until more tanks show up. Stay back, Germans. Gonna have to reload and get back in the trench. Got another? And the Bofors in the rear. Okay, what we really need is a damn med kit. All right, let's take position at the air defenses. You have to do so much in this game to keep the enemy off you. Ah! Shoot down enemy aircraft. Oh my god. This is not easy. Okay, we got him. I think we hit him. Oh my gosh. Way too many enemy aircraft here. Should have been paying at the guys closest to us. There's one. There's another. Too far. Way too far. How's it going, Jin? Um, yeah, neither have I. So this is Land of War. It's made by a Polish company. And uh, it's based on the German invasion of Poland. It's got some fictional stuff in it as well. From what I've understood. Reload. Shooting down the Luftwaffe one plane at a time. We're gonna stop sending attack planes pretty soon. All right, let's get back to the trench. Okay. We definitely deserve a medal after this. Weapon overheat, damn it! We're gonna have to get off this thing. Celaj zabi przeładuj. Ten cykl powtarzał się bez końca. Coraz mniej brałem pod uwagę, że strzały kierowane były do żywych istot, mających marzenia, ambicje. Tak samo jak ja, musiałem przestać postrzegać ich jako ludzi. Inaczej nie dałbym rady. So far, so good. Holy hell. Gotta get off. Take cover. Damn. Anything to stop them, boys, even if it means using the rifle. The one thing I wanted to use, we kept, we saw the, um, what's it called? The grenades before. What were the grenades? Actually not seeing it here in controls. Might just be a different weapon slot. Weapon change. Well, there's no weapon change button. Let's make it six. I see it. Okay, there we go. Nice. Man. 
massive amount of enemies. My goodness. Let's get back on the MG. He's actually bleeding. Look at that. That's intense. Like half his head is missing. Pretty brutal. Ura! Well, not Ura. We're Polish, but what should we say? Cześć? Dobranos? Get enemies or allies drop weapons. Use F to collect it. Makes sense. All right, so what did you guys think of the first mission? Interesting, right? A little interesting. Panowie, dostaliśmy informację, że Niemcy przejęli nasze bunkry, znajdujące się niedaleko stąd. Pojedziemy i połączymy się z będącymi w pobliżu siłami. Odbijemy je. Jakieś pytania? Panie poruczniku, ale ten samochód jest chyba za mały na nas. Yeah, I know a little Polish. I lived with my ex-girlfriend in Greenpoint, uh, which is in Williamsburg in Brooklyn. And it was mostly a Polish neighborhood. That's how I learned about Gabanos and uh, sauerkraut. I know sauerkraut is more German, but uh, the Polish really enjoy it. The redisposition point. All right, sounds good. Schlag. Co ty tam Piotrek mówiłeś wcześniej? Coś, że fajne było to? Zamknij się. Karma, chłopie. Karma. Karma. Da. Słyszysz? Coś blisko te strzały. Może dźwięk po prostu się niesie. Nie, to nie to. Bądź czujny. Polera nasz plut. Daleko nie zajechali. Oh boy, we got Germans here. They are right there, man. They're, they're effective. Space to jump, control to squat, shift to run. Okay, useful. Just curious to see that work. Not a good idea. Let's go ahead and use our med kit. Oh, we may need to grab another one. No, it's not going to be here. Let's use it while we've got it. There we go. And let's take this browning, guys. We've now got a browning. Look at this. A bar. Is this was this given to us by the Americans, I guess? Did that actually occur? I'm not sure now. All right, let's try out the browning. Or maybe the Polish browning? I don't know. Smone do smone. Oh shit. We're gonna need some uh, grenades. So far, not so good. Huh. I'm not liking that one bit. Well, let's switch to the grenade. At least we can get a few of them there. Ah! Damn! I'm just gonna have to pop up and shoot and pop back down. Damn it! It's gonna be a tough one. Hey, Endeavor! 
made their own bar under license. Oh, I see. I didn't know that, man. That's pretty cool. God damn. All right, let's switch to the browning. I can see why we're going to need to use it. Just to keep the enemy kind of suppressed. There's one. God bless the browning. Got another. Shoots through ammunition really quickly, though. Oh, shit. How are we going to get to the bunker defenses? Okay, we're going to slowly push forward. Got to grab that other med kit, too. Oh, man. Gonna try to hit him from a distance. Might have to get a grenade in there. But for now, I just want to kill all those riflemen. Oh, got one down, but not the machine gunner. I'm guessing we're gonna have to take all of them out and get a grenade in there. Man. I really do like the old school look of this game. Might not appeal to everybody though. Yeah, so from what I can see, we cannot damage that guy unless we get closer with a grenade. Lion24, how you doing, buddy? Yeah, I saw that. Um, that's I think that's one of the reasons I wanted to take a look at it. I reached out to them and they gave me a copy. I've heard very mixed reviews. I've heard like half people that love it and then half, half of the people really, really detest it. So... I'm enjoying it so far, um, but yeah, it's not the prettiest game, not by any stretch of the imagination. There we go, nice. Another rendezvous. I want to find some more grenades. Let me just head over here and make sure I haven't forgotten anything. They've got a machine gewehr as well. Yeah, we got a grenade out of that. Nice. Make sure to hit that like button, folks. It really helps big time. I know very few of you can do bits, but hitting like is the next best thing. Musimy iść dalej i spróbować odbić to, co zostało z naszej linii obrony. W lesie jest jednak pełno Niemców, a przed nami jeszcze dwa bunkry. Pewnie zajęte. Dobra, nie mamy czasu do stacji, nie ruszajmy. Może gdzieś jeszcze są nasi. Hello, Jakub. How you doing, man? And by the way, I just want to make this very clear. Um, like, a lot of people were complaining about the English voice actors for this game, and I agree, they were terrible. But these Polish voice actors are great. And so what I did was I just put English subtitles with Polish voice, and I think it works quite well. So I could see how that could kill immersion if people are listening to it in English. Come on, man. Agrippa needs a job. Like, come to me when you need voice acting. God's sake, I'll give you better voice acting in English. Oh, Germans. a bit crazy with with the damn grenade. I really wanted to use it. 
Tam się pewnie kierujemy, co? Tak, ale uważajcie. Do tej pory zdążyli już pewnie solidnie się tam okopać. Let's try the MP40. I'm also looking for more med kits, just kind of looking around. Where are they? There they are. Oh, I like that MP40. Unfortunately, wow, that's the first time we went down. That's the first time we went down. Not too bad. We are playing the realistic setting, so you can play the casual mode, which allows you to kind of enjoy the story. Um, or you can play the realistic mode, which is what we're doing now. We take some some actual losses here. Is it Coke or Pepsi? You you guys decide. Mamy ich. To pewnie był zjad. Przyszli od strony ostatniego bunkra. Tam się pewnie kierujemy, co? Tak, ale uważajcie. Do tej pory zdążyli już pewnie solidnie się tam okopać. Wow. Wow. Okay, we have to approach this differently. My goodness. We're not even getting a chance. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> you're correct, uh, Lion. I hate Pepsi. I hate Pepsi so much. Just that, like, super sweet taste. If I could drink, like, a uh, totally natural cola, I would drink that. This is the first Coke I've had in, um, four and a half weeks. So I've been pretty much staying away from soda. Um, I've totally given up booze for three months, so... It's pretty good. It's pretty delicious. Right. I don't see how we can get there. I mean, maybe we just have to remain all the way back. Because getting to that point, we are immediately killed. Mamy ich. To pewnie był zjad. Przyszli od strony ostatniego bunkra. Tam się pewnie kierujemy, co? Tak, ale uważajcie. Do tej pory zdążyli już pewnie solidnie się tam okopać. We're gonna approach really carefully. Find a way to the inside. Oh, we're already down to zero health. We're gonna have to wait for this to regain a bit. My goodness. People warn me that the game is like challenging at times and I didn't take them too seriously. Oh! Get some. Or bullet. Reload, baby. Oh, you played this before they added the difficulty option. Well, we didn't. We didn't. You know, we weren't cowards about it. We went for the for the actual uh, realistic difficulty setting. Otherwise, we maybe would just be blazing through here. Gotcha, bitch. Let's go. Oh, hello. Like a grenade. Still more in here, man. They are all over the damn place. Let's 
Second room time. Let's go get those health kits. In fact, we've got a grenade here. Let's just throw that in. How the hell did we get the grenade last time? There we go. Eat some. Yes, I think that worked pretty well. Let's go ahead and use that med kit. I like the sound of this one. It's got a cracking sound to it. Let's talk to the commander. Victory for Poland, boys. Oh, we got a little collectible as well. Yeah, I think I'm going to leave the BAR here. I'm a big fan of BARs, but this one is not the greatest. Again, it's a different model than the American one. Kowalski, zrobiliście kawał dobrej roboty. Dziękuję. Dziękuję. Żołnierze z drugiej linii obrony bardzo nam pomogli. Dziękuję. To moglibyśmy się nie przebić. No dobra, koniec chwalenia Kowalski. Macie następne zadanie. Niemcy przebijają się szybciej niż zakładaliśmy. Wiemy, że od północnego zachodu zbliżają się wrogie jednostki zmechanizowane. Musisz dotrzeć do pobliskiej radiostacji i wezwać wsparcie pociągu Piłsudczyka, by rozprawił się z tymi draniami. Tak jest. Spodziewamy się jakiegoś oporu? Droga powinna być czysta. Ale na wszelki wypadek zachowaj czujność. To co, Piotrek? Ruszamy. Give me one second, guys. Just want to um, drop this link one other place, and that's going to be the actual Discord of this game. Um, again, the developer was kind enough to reach out and uh, offer me a copy. And I think, to be honest, they were a little nervous because um, I asked for one. And despite not being a big channel, come on. You know, um, we still get, like, I would say 80% of the games we ask for, especially if they're, like, new games because we're considered press. Um, but these guys initially, you could tell, like, really didn't want to offer it, and I think it's because of all the negative reviews they've gotten. Um, but I think we kind of know what we're getting into. Like, this is my perspective so far, and tell me if you agree. It's kind of like a shooter on rails, um, and it's also very heavy into the actual story and events of the Polish invasion, so far, I almost see it as more of, like, a story shooter, if that makes sense, than anything else. Uh, but there's nothing wrong with that, you know what I mean? I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Um, let's see. Okay, thanks guys for the patience there. Let's get back to the game. Niestety, panie Henku, jest mi pan potrzebny do innego zadania. Dobrze, to ruszam. Bywajcie. Find a radio station. Okay. Fair enough. It begins. I will say this, like, especially if you're kind of into the invasion um, and into the defense of the invasion in particular, it's, um, you know, it sort of scratches that itch is, is the best way I could put it, you know? It's fun to have a shootout with these Germans and try and, you know, um, sort of weaken their invasion of Poland. Obviously, we know we can't stop it. It's inevitable, but maybe we could slow it down. So that's kind of cool. Yes, yeah, it's not it's not the prettiest game, that's for sure. I'm not, I'm not gonna, it's definitely not the prettiest game. I'm 
maybe there's going to be a radio up here. If not... Maybe not. Oh, shit! Wow! Okay. <laughs> Almost got killed. Radio. Okay, this is an interesting way to use the radio. Szeregowy Kowalski do Piłsudczyka. Szeregowy Kowalski do Piłsudczyka. Odbiór. Piłsudczyk zgłasza się. And again, I think using the Polish voice is so much better. A lot of people disliked it because of the American voice actors. Wow, operating an armored train. This is crazy. So A and D to move the camera. Move the mouse to shoot. You can also hold right click to direct enter direct fire mode from the closest artillery wagon. Wow. Fascinating, guys. This is fascinating. It's stuff like this that kind of makes a game somewhat original. Got one. Target obscured. There we go. Can't quite get the aim on them. Got to do better than that. Oh, he just backed up. Another down. Oh, this is the guy I really want to kill. Just can't seem to get a good shot on him. I'll try again. But see, that target reticule doesn't want to line up with him. There we go. Good work, boys. Good kill. Target destroyed. I don't think the Germans are getting in here, although they have damaged this armored train quite a bit. I don't think so. Beautiful. Z każdą minutą czułem, że coraz bardziej opuszczają mnie siły. A przecież to był dopiero początek. O powrocie do domu nie było już mowy. Zresztą do jakiego domu mokra nie mogła upaść. Yeah, absolutely, Lion. And the, the thing is, like, since they call it the beginning, I wonder if they already have stuff planned. Who knows? Zaraz po ataku. Okay, guys, we got through the first mission here in the game. It's fun. I mean, I'm, I've been, I'm enjoying it so far. Even if it's just, you know, a matter of a storyline and nothing else, it's pretty cool. We killed 111 Germans with 831 bullets fired. I like that sort of information in my games. Go to the next mission, folks. Walki przebiegają zgodnie z przewidywaniami. Biorąc pod uwagę naszą sytuację, może towarzyszyć jej lekki optymizm. Niech nas jednak to nie zwiedzie, ponieważ przyszłość nadal rysuje się w czarnych barwach. Niemcy tracą dużo sprzętu, jednak nam brakuje operatorów, a oni szybko uzupełniają swoje straty. Jeśli walki potrwają jednak wystarczająco długo, może uda nam się zmniejszyć różnicę sił. 
Zarządzamy przeniesienie punktu obrony do wsi Mokra. Wszystkie siły znajdujące się powyżej tej pozycji są zmuszone Don't forget to open fire and bayonet that like button, folks. Przemieszczeń. Niemcy będą z pewnością chcieli wykorzystać nasze posunięcia. Niektóre drogi wewnątrz kraju zostały już opanowane przez wrogów. Musimy uważać, by nie znaleźć się w kleszczach wroga. Teraz za dużo zależy od nas. A każda para rąk jest na wagę złota. Pretty beautiful. All right, looks like another battle coming up here. Thanks so much for sticking around, folks. Uh, it does seem like we got some people interested in the game, despite the very mixed reviews. Um, again, so far, too bad. Yeah, I, I can see it's not a AAA game at all, but uh, for the indie perspective and the story it's trying to tell, I like it, you know. We need the support of the unit station there. I expect 35 lads capable of fighting. Much depends on the success of your quest. All right, let's see. Mieliśmy ewakuować się do wsi Mokra. Jednak główna droga została zablokowana. Zamiast zbliżać się do celu, zaczęliśmy się od niego oddalać. Nie wiedzieliśmy jednak, jak bardzo. Oh, this is awesome. I love this. No, już się tak nie denerwuj nam. Teraz powinniśmy się skupić na tym, aby dojechać do tego punktu zbornego, a nie na kół. No, I haven't. Nie powinniśmy być daleko. Cholera, niemieckie motocykle za Oh no. Piotrek, zdejmij ich. Bugging. We got him. Oh, that was beautiful. I like this, guys. I like this. Just so much like action. It's sort of like an Indiana Jones movie as a game. We will not be captured. Go to hell, you German dogs. How am I supposed to kill an armored car? Blind the driver's viewfinder, no way! Alright, this is one of the most bizarre ways to stop an armored car. But if he can't see us, he can't shoot at us. Oh boy, we got a weapon overheat! Oh, goodbye, drive! Ho ho ho, okay! I'll take that. Yes! Yes, Lion, it feels a lot like that. A lot like the Medal of Honor games. Absolutely. Oh, neat. Um, do you have our um, our Discord information by chance? Uh, if you can drop that in disc, that would be awesome, man. Going through the camp. Gotta get the machine guns. Come on, boys. Well, they've got some explosive barrels as well. Holy hell. Talk about just action all over the place. The car is dead. Nope, we're moving. Damn. Straight through the barrier, folks. The Bolands! We shall never surrender! to overheat gonna have to kind of stop for a little bit Let's get a few bursts instead of holding down on this thing this is madness as my yeah, it is 
I could see, like, um, people that are arguing that it's not realistic. No, of course not. I mean, it's like a movie, you know? But I think you could still appreciate a game if it's not very realistic. It's sort of like a Rambo movie for Polish, uh, for the Polish resistance in World War II. I think. I like it, though, you know? It's a revenge game for the German invasion of Poland, is what it is. <laughs> they haven't noticed us yet. What? Well, we're not exactly desert rats, folks. Um, but the Germans might polish Polish rats, and they would be correct in this case because we're driving behind their lines, wasting them with a damn machine gun on the back of a vehicle. Gotta escape. Come on. <laughs> yes, that's true. Everybody give us an F for realism. That's for sure. But the game is not lost just because of that. For the bridge! Oh my gosh, look at this! <laughs> Wonderful! Like, see, just this is really neat. The ability to help out our guys on the trench. Boski <laughs> Fiat. Dive bomber. On our six. I don't see him. Oh boy. We winged him. We definitely winged him. But he's still flying. Gotta watch our back. Holy crap. Where is he? Where is he? There we go. All right. Not too bad. Got to the meeting point at least. Hello, boys. Good to see the Polish resistance here. Last remnants of the Polish army still fighting. Let's do it. Evacuation time, boys. Gotta pull out before the Germans can completely annihilate us. I see 20 viewers and 11 likes, boys. Let's get some mutual aid in here. Support Poland with that thumbs up. Or risk being turned over to the Germans. Got 
Gotta watch out. We're still passing through our line here. Here we go, boys. Gotta watch out for the overheat as well. I don't know what achievement I unlocked. I can't even look at it. Too busy shooting Germans. There we go, we got a few more likes there. That's what I'm talking about. Rugged path. Nice, boys. Pretty cool, guys. Pretty cool. Now, that time we fired so many bullets uh, due to the machine gun. I like that mission. And again, was it realistic? Hell no. But I thought it was enjoyable, you know? I don't know how much they're actually asking for this game. That's a big determining factor on whether this is worth it. It's like 20 bucks. Yeah, I would say pick it up. If it's like 40 bucks, I would say no, you're asking a bit much. Dzięki bohaterstwu naszych żołnierzy napór wroga został spowolniony. Nasi przeciwnicy są wyraźnie zaskoczeni oporem, jaki napotykają. Dostaliśmy informację o polskim oddziale na terytorium III Rzeszy. Nie jesteśmy pewni, w jaki sposób tam się znaleźli, ale zamierzamy wykorzystać ich położenie. Ich głównym celem będzie odbić... Rescuing POWs, this is awesome. Przeprawa nie będzie jednak prosta. Więźniowie są przetrzymywani wewnątrz bunkrów, będących częścią okopów, a niemieccy żołnierze mogą czyhać za każdym rogiem. Atak na te pozycje musi być skoordynowany. Część oddziałów zaatakuje od strony okopu, a w tym czasie reszta będzie prowadzić akcję dywersyjną. Ryzyko wielkie. Nie możemy jednak zostawić naszych. The Vidya. I haven't seen that since Chris Chan memes. The Vidya. Ruszyłem wraz z grupą w głąb okopu. Początkowo szło nieźle, ale niedługo później wpadliśmy w zasadzkę. Ja i moje pieprze na szczęście. Otoczyli nas. Musimy się przebić. All right, let's go. Let's regain the position with stationary weapons. So it's actually suggesting we use a machine gun, but maybe not yet. Maybe later on in the fight. Stationary weapons like machine guns, mortars, things like that. Hey Anthony, how you doing, bud? Awesome to have a channel member here. We know Anthony will give a like. That's that's for sure. Shouldn't have gone for the hip fire. Shouldn't have gone for the hip fire. That was weird. You guys see that? That's people were talking about glitches like this. Ruszyłem wraz z grupą w głąb okopu. 
Początkowo szło nie. jump back for a second there. Niedługo później wpadliśmy w zasadzkę. Ja i moje pieprzone szczęście. Otoczyli nas. Musimy się przebić. Let's do it. Uważaj. We're gonna have to get a medkit. We're gonna let the men go forward first. Musimy teraz odbić drugą stronę. It's gonna be down this way for sure. Can be close. No, can't go for the damn hip fire here. I, I just, my bad. I just have to stay back. Let's see if it does that reload thing again. Ruszyłem wraz z grupą w głąb okopu. Początkowo szło nieźle, ale niedługo później wpadliśmy w zasadzkę. Ja i moje pieprzone szczęście. Otoczyli nas! Let's do this. Musimy Come on now. Przebić. We're better than this. Now we're just going to keep our distance. Maybe I can like move forward and push back like this. Yep. Eh, it didn't really work. Kind of did. I hope this guy can cover us. Got him. Nice. Let's reload. Would like a med kit though, it'd make me feel a little bit safer. And we're gonna need to replace this browning anyway. See the med kit. Spasiba. All right, let's head back to our men over here. Love how there's like mud on the guns, like just that level of kind of griminess I enjoy. I know it doesn't make or break the game, but it's kind of cool. Ooh, that was really close. I think if we had not used the med kit, we'd have been dead there. Regain another abutment. Sounds good. Let's use some of that health. We need some additional ammo. We're running pretty, pretty uh, close to dry. We've got a lot of Germans to deal with st uh, still. Ah! That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, this is the first time we've been pretty low on ammo. I like that, though. I like that we're running low on ammo. Oh, grenade! Got one. Got two. It's only a matter of time, my friends. The 
Get some rounds in the machine pistol. Oh, boy. Got him. Oh, come on. He was in my way. We're going to have to go look for another weapon. Just run across. And it looks like we have plenty of weapons over here. Boom, boom. Oh, it's a car 98. Okay. To use the uh, enemy's poison against them. Gotcha. I like it. Wonderful action on this. I was worried about that. I was worried about that. That was pretty sneaky. So they were kind of waiting back there. As soon as we approached, they all sort of did a little counterattack. So we just have to keep our distance as usual. Kowalski, tutaj. Kowalski, tutaj. Let's do it, boys. Reloading. What are your guys' opinions on the game so far? I, I want to get some, like, honest opinions here in chat. Um, do you guys like it? Do you think it's kind of cheap? Like, what's what are your thoughts? My bad aim. Got him. Got him. We need to try and get as much ammo as possible here. All right, let's use the three rounds in this first. Come on. Gotta aim low. There we go. I like the blood effects. That's not too bad. Oh shit, grenade! Oh, no way! No way! With the grenade! All right, at least they're throwing nades. That adds to the action for sure. Uh, for an indie, it's enjoyable, and there is clearly passion and effort put into it, unlike most big budget AAA games today. Yeah, I, I, I agree. Like, definitely there's some passion here. Um, no doubt about it. You can tell that the creators really care about this conflict, and I think that that alone is, um, is really cool. I think another big mistake they made... Um, I'm not sure if this is part of the game, but if you guys see the actual, like, um, the game, um, the cover of the game, there's kind of, like, a sci-fi element to it, and I'm not so sure that was a good idea. Like, you know, you're already going for something really niche. Why not just, just stick with that? And so far, we haven't seen anything sci-fi. It's just basically the invasion of Poland, so I don't know. I think the marketing could have, could have been a bit better. Nice. I'm learning to use this weapon a little better. You really just have to, like, click with the machine pistol. Don't auto-fire it. Just kind of click it. Nope. I want that. Come on. You gotta be shitting me, man. Some of this stuff also... I don't know if this is totally true, but it seems, like, pre-scripted. Um, like, if you advance too far when the guy's crossing, you get easily killed. But if you're a ways away and he's still shooting you, you don't take as much damage. Little stuff like that that I could see uh, people get frustrated with.
Reload. I was trying to get into cover. Damn. Damn. A bit unforgiving there. Yeah, they definitely make you earn victory. The sci-fi part is more hidden in the background. One part of the mission shows a guy dead in an experimental or electric chair. Interesting. Okay, I see what you mean. Yeah, kind of to exaggerate the already awful German experiments. That does make sense. Yeah, it's getting a little more challenging. Initially, we were kind of steamrolling through it. Now it's uh, a little more challenging. I like how it sort of, sh you know, throws off your aim if they're hitting you. There we go. I think we probably need to use the med kit in this situation. Come on. No way. That's that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. <laughs> oh man. All right. We'll try again. It's almost like we have to kind of let him come out before we have a chance to actually do damage. So fair enough. Finally took cover, at least. Finally. All right. So, yeah, you just kind of have to, like, lure him out here. They're going to throw a grenade now. All right. All right. All right. I'll take that. Let's go, boys. On to victory. One. Got another. Yeah, I want to be very cautious moving up here. Oh, no, 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 no. My bad, my bad. Oh, we did kill him. We did kill him dancing with bullets, but we went down. My God. So I don't like the fact that it sort of makes you advance to get that guy to push forward. And when he does, if you don't kill him within seconds, you're finished. Um, it kind of reminds me of, like, you know, like the old 1980s or even 1990s um, dungeon games where you had to beat a boss in a certain way. It's kind of reminding me of that a bit. Like, now we kind of know how to walk through this area. We're pretty good at just getting to this point, at least. Oh. So we get to this point. 
We lure the guy, then we run behind cover. It's very scripted. That's very scripted. That's for sure, Mike. Um, like I, like somebody said, Call of Duty earlier. It, it almost reminds me of like Call of Duty Two, um, but a sort of a mod. I forgot about the fucking grenade. You gotta be kidding me! Give me a break, boys and girls. <laughs> Give me a break. But yeah, there's definitely a Call of Duty feel to it. Take cover. Wait till he reloads. Roger that. Kowalski. Goodbye. not working let's get a little closer yeah that works that worked oh you son of a bitch now let's use that med kit now we have to get them to throw the grenade get out of the way survive that first of all not taking any chances now oh you know what we could really use is a grenade to throw into that uh that group over there in the northeast got him because they kill us nearly every single time we go over there. <laughs> oh boy. behind cover this time let's hope it works there's a grenade he's gonna throw that's insane that is insane all right well i can't believe we actually made it but all right i'm amazed i'm amazed Patience is a virtue, folks. Patience is a virtue. <sighs> nice. Got a whole bunch of ammunition now. What now, boys? Kowalski. Sprawdź, co się dzieje na przodzie tego korytarza, tylko ostrożnie! Tak jest, panie poruczniku. że zdążyłem samą porę z tym gniazdem. Już myślałem, że jest po nas. Jestem twoim dłużnikiem. Przebiliśmy się przez środek okopu resztą oddziału. Chodźcie za mną. Dołączymy do reszty i przygrupujemy się.
Dobra. Reszta naszej drużyny jest na końcu tego korytarza. Piotrek, pójdź im pomóc. W bunkrach hey, dalej Niemcy trzymają jeńców. Musimy ich uwolnić. I know Mike and Shin, you guys have really wanted to do some uh, arma. Um, so what I'll do after this is we'll we'll start the server up so you guys can at least get on. All right, let's join our allies. And yeah, we're trying to actually save prisoners of war. Reload. Shit. Completely misjudged that. He's got a World War One mustache. Hello. Thought that was a helmet. I think so far the machine pistol is my favorite weapon. Oh, shit. Oh, and we killed him before dying as well. <laughs> and that goes for anybody else that wants to be part of our Armia Krajowa and Arma 3. Um, the only requirement is that you're a channel follower um, and that also you are part of our Discord. You can play with us. Uh, it's, it's fun. We have fun in there. It's basically an anti-Stasi mod um, where you play as Polish Resistance. see that <laughs> you got to know exactly where the grenades are going to be but there are grenade indicators so it's it's my own damn fault there we go 17 watching 17 likes that's what i like to see guys a uh, lion now's a great time man i'm pretty sure you are on our discord um if not we can give you the discord link but you should join us um you don't need to get any mods or anything like or any dlc i should say you do have to download mods uh, and it can be a really rewarding experience in addition to the game itself. Like, it's pretty cool. It's very open-ended. All right, guys, we got to throw in ads every now and again. If, if there's no super chat, we have to throw in a few ads at the very least. So see, in that situation, we actually had to move forward to avoid the grenade. But that put us in more danger. Oh! Like he had infinite firepower there. Don't think so. Oh, no worries, man. That's fine. Yeah, just jump into the Polish Home Army section and uh, just say, you know, who you are or whatever. And um, after I'm done with this stream, we'll we'll open it up for you guys. I don't know if I can play. I've got to go get some food um, here in a bit. But I'll at some point play with you guys, um, you know, whether I show up earlier or whatever. Oh, not this again. the hell wow not have expected that at all got him all right make sure that we're ready on rifle ammo
I like the bullet animations or, or just the bullets themselves. You could see it's hit him. I had to move forward because of the nade. I had no choice. <laughs> I had no choice. Those nades will get you. Reload. The, I think I'll, I'll say right now the biggest disappointment in the game, I know what it is now, it's that um, since, the, since every single one of these fights is like basically a cinematic pre-recorded fight, you know, they always throw the grenade at the same time, for instance. They always show up at the same time. That that makes it a little more of like a story than really like an open-ended shooter. Um, and I think that's its biggest flaw. It's just like, no, make the AI respond in different ways every time. Like maybe one time they throw the grenade at, at a certain moment, maybe the next time they throw it at another. Here we can kind of like over time anticipate what they're gonna do. You guys know what I mean? And that's that takes away from the game, I think. Just a personal opinion, but I am the, I am the reviewer after all. <laughs> Uh, it doesn't make a difference because you can't kill your own men, I don't believe. Give me just 20 seconds, folks. Got to go use the uh, the little boy's room. I'll be right back. I'm going to turn off the, the mic temporarily because I don't want you guys to hear that. Uh, thank you so much for the likes, guys. Support any way you can. Be right back. All right, guys. By the way, I'm not sure if anybody noticed. Um, have you guys seen the change to the channel name? And is it something you approve of? Um, again, we are still like technically as as a, as an entity, we're still Agrippa Maxenius. But I changed our our basically our main name to just Agrippa. Um, and the reason being on search engines and stuff like that. People make the mistake, I've seen it nonstop, of putting in, like, Agrippa Maximus, Agrippa uh, uh, Maximius. Like, they just can't remember the fucking Maxentius. That's just the truth. I, I, hate to I hate to say that people are that dumb, but that seems to be the case. So we've shortened it to just Agrippa, and that's already pretty challenging for some people, but I'm hoping that that'll make it easier for people to find us. And what's hilarious is the day after changing it... Um, we got about 2,000 more views. Now, I don't know if the name change had anything to do with it, but I think it's kind of funny. All right, so we know they're going to toss a grenade here at some point. No, no one's gonna help. Oh, we can request an aid kit. Hey, I didn't know that. That's pretty cool. That's really cool. It's a historic moment. <laughs> Indeed. Uh, I'm gonna see if we can maybe request grenades, I wonder. No.
Ah, there it is! Oh, just barely got out of the way. No chance for you, Fritz. You gotta be kidding me, even back here? Holy shit. You gotta be kidding me. Wow. Okay, well, at least we know where the guy's charging through. Man. Let's do it again. I'm not giving up. The Polish army never, never surrenders. Except when they do, of course. Oh, nice. Single shot got him. All right, let's get them to throw the nade. I think it's over here. Nope, not yet. Let's move up a bit. Throw the nade. Back up. See, that's what's, that's the game's biggest problem is you know that stuff's gonna occur every time in the same way. So, it's just kind of like learning the, the steps to get through. They've got to add more AI, more reactive AI. That's going to respond no matter what, you know? It's our only chance is to get him here. My God, finally. Jeez. And I'm sure now we're gonna have to deal with grenades. Got him. getting shot behind that's right there's the guy behind us that bastard oh no i won't oh no i won't i will not 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 for this mission at least not for this mission the smoke effects on the guns are also a nice touch ouch Come on. Come on. Gotcha. Back up a bit. That's right. We can get a med kit from that other guy. We can't forget about that. Let's head back. Back to our side of the trench. Uh-oh. I don't think our buddies are here anymore. Still got one med kit, though. Try a German MP40. I just keep backing up because I know that a grenade is coming eventually, so I don't want to be the uh, unfortunate victim of that blast. Got him. So many Germans left. Ah! Got him. Okay, there's the grenade. 
All right, all right. Another one? Really? How many grenades do they have? No. No. No, how in hell am I missing? My God. All right, let's reload. A bit shell-shocked. Got him. Want to make sure there's no more grenades coming over here, though. Ouch, 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 ouch. Die, you bastard. I want to make sure they don't rush us. They could try to rush us on this end, and there's actually a med kit over there, which I want to get my hands on. Nope, nope, bad, 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 bad. Gotcha. Fortunately, no ammunition. We'd have to grab that. Good time to check for grenades anyway. Back up. <clears throat> like how some of the MP40s are all dirty and some of them are just looking beautiful here. This is our land. Come on. All right, let's get to the prison and rescue our Polish friends. Hey, tutaj. Błagam cię, wypuść mnie. Rozwal tę kłódkę albo coś. Nie zniosę ani chwili dłużej w tym końcu. Really? How do we break the lock? There we go. Dziękuję. Took long enough. Myślałem, że to już mój koniec. Dziękuję. Holy shit. Oh, I don't know if we can actually kill this guy. We might just need to try and rush out of here somehow. See? No, we're not getting hits on him. Got him. Okay, it works. It works. Patience is key in this game, that's for sure. Oh, shit. I should have known. Whoa! Another grenade. My goodness. I want to get to the end of this uh, particular this particular battle, at least. Hey, tutaj. Błagam cię, wypuść mnie. Rozwal tę kłódkę albo coś. Nie zniosę ani chwili dłużej w tym końcu. Jest. Dziękuję. Myślałem, że to już mój koniec.
Yeah, exactly, Lion. Exactly. It wants you to kind of to watch the story and watch the the battle unfold, sort of. You get that uh, that feeling for sure. Kowalski, tutaj. Got him. Can't forget about the grenade here. Got him. Yep. Wool on the eye. Tagged him. He's not dead, but he felt that, that's for sure. Cover is wonderful. Ktoś tu jest? Hey, pomóż nam! Jesteśmy zamknięci. Oh my gosh. Jest. Ogromne dzięki. Panowie, bierzemy broń i wracamy do walki. All right, wonderful. Got some of our men back. Wait a minute. What's this MG doing here? Are we gonna have to hold out? Yeah, I agree, Stan. I agree. Powinniśmy tam znaleźć ładunki. Świetnie. Prowadź. The price really has to match. If it's like ten, like the same price as a movie. That's how much it should be. Because <coughs> it's basically a movie. With a little interaction. Oh, I don't know how we're going to make it through here. This is going to be a tough one. Seizing the ammunition depot. Got one. Got two. Oh! Oh! Now, I like the aim in that situation, because since we were crawling, we weren't exactly aiming, but our uh, barrel was in his direction. I like that. That's, cr that's pretty cool. Oh, this shit again. I hate that. So they always have this, like, animation of one of the guys kind of, like, just... You guys know what I mean. You can see it. You can see it. That, that's, that I don't like. Now we just have to wait for him to yeah, wait for him to shoot his whole clip, and there we go, we're in. Time to take the charges. Alright, let's destroy this artillery. Whoa! Whoa! They didn't tell me that, that was gonna happen. Come on, man. Come on. Stuff like that, you need warnings, but okay. Yeah, see, that to me seems more likely. It doesn't seem like a safe thing to do to try and shoot a lock with a pistol. It really doesn't. I know it's done in, like, movies and stuff. All right, at least it didn't force us to go all the way back. Got 
one. Probably better to use the rifle in this situation. Got two. Got three. One more and you're down. Well, me too, but him as well. Here we go. Gotcha, bitch. Right through the chest. Now I'm going to switch back to the MP40. Whoa! 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 That was unexpected. That was unexpected as well. That was very unexpected. All right, here we go. Ooh, 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 you little bastard. You will not survive. Yep, exactly. Exactly, yeah. Like, the, and the grenades make a great um, example of that. Of how it wants you to be stealthy, but then it throws, like, grenades at Like, for what reason? And they're always in the same place. It's, it's stuff like that that could really be improved here. I definitely think these guys shouldn't give up on, like, future games. Um, you know, since this one is called the beginning, the next one they could do, like, some serious improvements. Let's go to a safe distance. You know what it is, though? Uh, the one thing I do get from the game... Shit. Come on. One thing I do get from the game is, like, satisfaction. Um, especially when you complete one of the objectives. There is a level of satisfaction there that's fun. Oh, interesting. Should be able to hit him. Yeah. Gotcha. That works. No chance for you. Yeah, absolutely. It has potential. That, that's for sure. Yeah, at least each animation's a little different. That's fun. It's like an underhand stab. Now let's switch back to the machine gear. Powinienem odejść na bezpieczną odległość. Oh, 
Okay. As long as we get through, I don't care. I hear Germans. Oh! Gotcha. This is sloppy design, for instance. That's sloppy design. Right in the old family jewels. Reload. Holy shit. Oh, machine gun. Okay, let's get the rifle. No, we're gonna have to wait till we get back up to 50. Not pushing it. Do we have any med kits? Yeah! Come on, shoot at me. Oh, man. Doesn't take him long to reload. on come on you gotta be kidding me how are we supposed to get through that okay we did a little damage there we did a little damage we're just gonna have to work him down little by little <laughs> he's got a little bit of uh got a little bit of shells in him a few shells in him so i think uh We'll be hurting. Got him. Another gun. Won't even think about it. that I picked up all the ammunition here. I think I have one, two, three. War German guns destroyed. Destroy the 88. Hey, Odena. What's up, buddy? Probably gonna have to fight Germans coming from this location now. What did I tell you? I don't know if that's a German or one of our guys. I think it might be one of our dudes. Another secret collectible? I'm not sure of the value of these. Battle of Vester Plata? I've never seen it. A jednak nam się udało. Cóż, przynajmniej części z nas. Załadowaliśmy się do ciężarówki. I pojechaliśmy połączyć się z naszymi siłami przy wsi Mokra. Taki przynajmniej był plan. All right, guys. 77 German casualties, 487 bullet count. How long have we been streaming here? I want to see. Um, quite a while, I'm sure. Let's see. All right, um, let's just see what the next mission's about. I'm curious. Go 
Kolejne punkty obrony padają. Armia III Rzeszy jest coraz głębiej na polskiej ziemi. Niemcy są brutalni. Wciąż liczymy straty. Nie jesteśmy w stanie dłużej utrzymać pozycji we wsi Mokra, dlatego zarządza się ewakuację. Kilka ataków zostało odpartych, jednak napór przeciwników ciągle rośnie. Trzeba wydostać stamtąd rannych i ludność cywilną, a następnie skierować się w stronę Warszawy. W północno-wschodniej części wioski znajdują się ciężarówki przygotowane do tego celu. Wydostańmy stamtąd tylu ludzi, ilu tylko zdołamy. Wow. We actually have to try and evacuate uh, people. Immediately withdraw your force to the camp located in Niezno. There you will help repair a defense. No heroics. We can't lose anyone else. Damn, yeah, man. Wyjechaliśmy na Sky Wsi. Nauczeni poprzednimi doświadczeniami, postanowiliśmy zostawić ciężarówkę w bezpiecznej odległości. Końcowy odcinek pokonać na piechotę. Byliśmy tacy podekscytowani. Tacy naiwni. Chłopaki, patrzcie! To cholerne pobojowisko. To była istna rzeź. Niemcy musieli ich zaskoczyć. Szkopy wchodzą w głąb kraju jak gorący nóż w masło. Przestań tak mówić. Zobaczysz. Oh, now we've got a PBSH. Well, a Polish PBSH. A Morsch. Chciałbym być takim optymistą. Pretty cool. It's got a uh, stick ammunition instead of the uh, drum. A linia frontu ciągle depcze nam po piętrach. Dobra, to idziemy. Trzymajcie palec na spuście. Nie wiadomo, gdzie są. Tak jest. Musimy sprawdzić, co te dranie jeszcze zrobili ze stromownością. Spójrzcie na to. Szwaby zablokowali drogę ciężarówką. Pewnie chcieli utrudnić ucieczkę reszcie osób. Broń w pogotowiu, panowie. Tadek, Henie, pomóż się mi z tym. Reszta nich osłania. So 25 rounds. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Moździerze, uciekaj za zasłony! It was a booby trap. Panik, Piotrek, musisz niszczyć ten CKM jak najszybciej. Broń machine gun. Oh! 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 Trzymajcie. Oh boy. Man, they're everywhere. We need grenades. It's another thing, the game gives you very few grenades. I like the gun though. Doesn't sound like a PPSH should, it sounds like a heavy machine gun. Oh, this is a new weapon. Semi-automatic. Gun. Love the sound. Just sort of like the clinging, just the ding, ding, ding. Wonderful. All right, let's flank that HMG. Is that med kit? Come on. 
Got him. I love this gun. Definitely my new favorite in the game. Oh boy. Whoa. Okay, not expected. In any case, guys, I think we definitely played enough of the game. The stream seems to be dying down a little bit. And uh, that's all right, because we've almost done two hours in this game. Um, my final verdict is going to be like a solid, <laughs> a solid six out of ten. Um, I wish I could give it a higher ranking, but there's just like, it's a little too scripted. I love the story. I think the story is tremendous. Like if I could just rate it on the story alone and sort of the, not even the immersion, but just like the cultural immersion, I guess you could say, I would give it like an eight out of 10 or a nine out of 10, but there's just stuff here they need to fix. The predetermined grenade throws. I've seen people complain about that before and I, I can totally see what they mean, you know, like. I can, I can totally see what they mean with that. That's really, that gets just really annoying. It's like, you know, it's basically like I'm playing a dungeon game and I know when the boss is going to strike. So I need to remember when to jump back when the boss strikes. You know what I mean? It's that sort of thing. And I don't know. Um, I wouldn't say that, but I would say you got to be into this particular conflict. Keep in mind that this is, <clears throat> you know, of course, um, an indie game. Um, so don't expect like, you know, AAA graphics. Don't expect AAA gameplay and anything like that. Um, but I can definitely see the criticisms that some people have. Uh, now, that being said, we have been playing Warhammer 2 Total War on Twitch. I really would love to see some more of you guys stop by there because I know quite a few of you uh, that enjoy watching me here would probably like to watch me on Twitch. Maybe not for all of the games I play, but we've been playing quite a few strategy games. So there's the Twitch link before we get to this two-hour mark. Um, and I'm also going to put down the Discord link so again, I'm about to play a little bit of Arma 3 here with some uh, followers in Discord. Anybody is willing to join. <clears throat> We're playing with the Armia Krajova, and it's just going to re require a little mod download um, if you have Arma 3, and you can join up with us. You can play, do missions with us, and maybe even get featured in a video in the future. So let me go ahead and drop that here. Also, I'm going to let Jin know we're playing soon. Um... And let me give you guys the Discord link here. I want to thank everybody for stopping by. If you are new here, make sure to follow us. Um, subscribe to us, I guess. And if you're just a regular, then thank you so much for stopping by. Obviously, you know what to do. Uh, if you can, once the video uploads, drop a comment. I would greatly appreciate it. I'm more forgiving when it comes to indie games. Exactly, Lion. That's how I feel. That's how I feel. I look, I think that they had a great story. I think the execution could have been greatly improved. For me, this is like a lesson for the future for them. Um, I actually look at this as like sort of a positive thing. I don't think it's horrific. I think it's not great. Um, and I think in the future, as long as they work on those things, they can make just an amazing game. Um, I don't even think they should stay away from this like story approach because I think they're quite good at telling a story. They really are. So there's nothing wrong with the story approach. There's nothing wrong with it not being an open world game, but you've got to have, like, you got to get rid of that, like, automatic grenade throw thing. Like, let the AI do its own thing. You know what I mean? Like, maybe you could, sometimes it could be more aggressive. Sometimes it could stay back a bit more. Just let it have, let the AI have its own personality, I guess is my point. Thank you so much, guys. Take care. Fun time. I like this stream. Despite not being a massive fan of the game, I would still recommend it to people that really want it. I haven't looked at the price, admittedly, um, but I still had fun doing this. So I'll catch you on the next one, guys, and we will be streaming Warhammer 2 uh, as the Orcs on Twitch later today or tomorrow. Thanks so much. Take care. And those of you that want to join me in Arma 3, Armia Krajova, I know that Mike and um, Skin are going to stop by there. 
uh, please feel free, and we'll get even more of you involved in the Polish Home Army. Thanks so much, folks.